We wake again to tragic news from both ends of Queensland about the youth crime crisis ripping our state. A carjacking in Townsville, a terrible home invasion in Brisbane, and again, we repeat our call to the government, restore breach of bail as an offence in the Youth Justice Act. To explain why that matters, I've asked Shadow Attorney General Tim Nichols. Tim, why is this an essential thing to occur? Well, David, we need to empower the police to be able to grab these young kids before they commit a second offence. And really the question is this, are they going to steal one car or are they going to steal two? And if we can grab them after they've stolen one car and stop them from stealing the second, if they breach bail, then the community is safer and they are less likely to go down a path of crime and cost to the community and worry and concern. So one car or two. And the other reason is there have to be consequences for actions. And young people understand that if they breach bail, there'll be a consequence. And that makes them safer and it makes our community safer. So breach of bail being restored makes the community safer and it's better for those young kids. Well, there it is. We haven't asked for a shopping list of things. We've supported every change that's been taken to the parliament, but we ask the government, please, stop being pig-headed, restore breach of bail as an offence in the Youth Justice Act, and let's take a step towards a safer Queensland.